If you had uh, the virus and uh, you can still get the vaccine or will you need to wait for the rollout as it continues around the state? Our vaccine team is looking for the answers. Here's Jenna Krasina. So we recommend that everybody who can get the vaccine be able to get it and that includes people who have had COVID. As the COVID-19 vaccine continues to be offered, many find themselves recovered from the virus. But MUSC Dr. Katrika Kapali says that won't stop anyone from being able to get the vaccine. I would really recommend that if it's your turn to get vaccinated, uh, to just go ahead and get vaccinated um, if it's your turn and not wait because it's really a scarce uh, vaccine to get. And so unless there's a good reason for you uh, not to be able to get the vaccine, um, I would just go ahead and get it. As for the reasons not to get the vaccine, Kapali says there aren't many. If you're one of these people who got sick with COVID and received one of these monoclonal antibody infusions, then you would not be able to get the vaccine for 90 days after getting the infusion. So that would be one reason to be cautious of it. Um, that's really the only main reason. And then again, um, there are some people uh, who have certain um, uh, allergic reactions that they may need to consult with their physician before going ahead and receiving the vaccine. Which Kapali has done. She received both doses and is excited to help others protect themselves from the virus. I think we're doing everything we can to help get the vaccine in arms of everybody, not just here in Charleston, but all over the state. Jenna Kurzina, News 19 WLTX. Well, we're being told that MUSC is helping to administer the vaccine. So far, they say they're filling up quickly and booked all the way into March.